Hey guys, Shyam here. And one of the most favorite things that I like about making videos is that the quality. So as you probably know, I shoot all my videos in 4K, but they actually look better in quick time when I open it after exporting than they look on YouTube. I mean, it actually looks great on YouTube. You can watch it at 4K, 120fps, 60fps, 30fps, and all of that. But it actually looks better when I'm playing it directly after exporting. Sometimes when I'm watching my own videos on YouTube, I get a question in my mind that why do I spend all of that time in those color adjustment, sharpening, stabilization? Because at the end of the day, you're going to watch my video on a phone or a laptop. Because of YouTube compression, all of this uh, data that uh, I post process is less visible to you than it is to me. Anyways, this is all because YouTube needs to compress the files that we upload. Uh, it compresses them into a 720p video, a 1080p video, a 1440p video, a 2k video, and a 4k video. So when YouTube's compressing all that data, uh, it's basically mapping all those pixels to a bigger pixel making the noise look less obvious and those color adjustments look less obvious. So for example if I upload this crispy beautiful 4k file onto YouTube uh, this is going to be about 5 3 to 5 GB and if I upload it on YouTube and download it again it's only going to be like a few megabytes. YouTube compresses all this data to deal with all the traffic it's getting every second every month. That being said I want to see how serious is YouTube compression which means that I'm going to upload a video, let it process, download that, upload that, let it process, download that. I'll do it until the footage starts breaking apart 500 times or so and at every milestone I'll put a number here or here and you can see how is it breaking apart. Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video start to break apart this is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020 alright I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube download it upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video start to break apart. This is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020. Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video starts to break apart. This is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020. Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video starts to break apart. This is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020. Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video start to break apart. This is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020. Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video starts to break apart. This is a test to see how serious Alright, I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video.
all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload this to youtube download it upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload this to youtube download it upload it again and again and again until the all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload this to youtube download it upload it again and all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload this to youtube download it all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload this to youtube all right i'm in a room and i'm recording my voice and my video and i'm going to upload all right I'm in a room and I'm recording my voice and my video and I'm going to upload this to YouTube, download it, upload it again and again and again until the characteristics of my voice and my video starts to break apart. This is a test to see how serious is YouTube compression in 2020. Alright, so now that you've seen all the videos, you can see that after every minor or major upload. Uh, the frame and the video starts to break apart and I'll have all the major milestones linked down in the description below I'll have the channel which I uploaded all these videos linked down below because I'll create a new channel for this All right, that's been it. I'm happy to share it with you of my weeks and weeks of uploading and downloading a video from YouTube and if you want other people to see this video and learn more about YouTube compression Please do share and like this video, subscribe if you want more content. That's it for me, thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.